only thing you... Counselor, can you just say, just say and spell your name so these guys can Robert the Gottlieb, G-O-T-T-L-I-E-B. Just mentioned uh, what, what's happened uh, today is uh, we've received um, paperwork. Uh, the paperwork lists the various items that were seized uh, pursuant to uh, search warrants and uh, in other ways. Uh, the actual uh, information, the videos, have not been received. Uh, that's why I've made a point of insisting uh, that the uh, that the prosecutors turn over the copies of uh, the videos at the scene that they say they have, and any of the actual hard uh, data from the search of or the searches of the computers, as well as the cell phones. Uh, all of that information is essential uh, to move this case forward say also that we intend to make a very serious bail application uh, that will be filed with the court uh, next week. Uh, in this country, the Constitution, our laws provide for reasonable bail. Uh, we're cognizant of the serious nature of the charges, but that does not resolve the issue of bail. We intend to include in our bail application, electronic monitoring, that will be the responsibility of the family to pay for. Uh, that and other uh, components will be included in our bail application. List the charges. List, list the charges. Yeah, the charge is murder in second degree and criminal possession of a weapon. Two counts of criminal possession of a weapon. How is your client these days? What's his demeanor? He's very hopeful. He's very optimistic. Remains in protective custody. Uh, he's been receiving uh, uh, medical attention, but he is very upbeat. Uh, he knows what happened here, why it happened. We have discussed in the past the issues that could very well be ultimately heard in, in court. So right now, he is very optimistic. Why the continued? That uh, uh, speaks for itself. This is a very high, highly charged case. Uh, many people are uh, very, very uh, concerned about uh, Mr. Camello's safety, the safety of his family. And so to make sure that uh, justice can be done in this case, we uh, requested protective custody and the Department of Corrections has followed through and he remains and will remain in Mr. Gala, what do you that in the hearing? Were, were you referring specifically to your client, or did you are they continuing to do protective custody for his family too? The protective custody I refer to is uh, his protective custody. Are you able to speak at all on anything related to his family? No. Mr. Gala, what do you expect to find on his uh, hard drives? I know you. I have an open mind. I will find what I find. Uh, I fully expect. Uh, to receive that uh, information quickly, and we will have it analyzed. Thank you. All right. Thank, Thank you very, you very much. much.